Hello there guys, welcome back to episode 4 of this gameplay. We're doing really well at the moment, second in the league. Um, leads are flying, but that's just simply who leads are on this game. Uh, I know that we should be doing a bit better, but unfortunately we're not. Um, so, Ray Parla is going to come in for Youngberg in this case. Now this is a must win, two home games to come in a row here, Villa and Everton. Um, Desperate for the points here just to keep up the pace with Leeds. Um, it's a good start after five minutes there. Uh, Robert Perez, he seems to enjoy playing in that role, that attacking midfielder. Um, so we're going to keep him in that position. Obviously, Youngberg can play there as well. Um, Jermaine Pennant can. That's what I prefer to bring on. He seems to be my go-to sub whenever Perez is a bit tired in the game. Uh, but that's not a bad, a bad start, to be honest. 3-0, uh, that's good, okay, I'm happy with that, Duff getting in on it as well, okay, Everton after this, Everton are 7th currently at the moment, it's mad that we're only getting 38,000 fans at home, hardly the Emirates is it, oh look at Schmeichel playing a 4, that's bad that, Bergkamp there, right, we can start to think about bringing some people off here, um, I'm going to bring on Ray off. I'm going to give him a bit of a rest. I think he deserves a rest. Let's get Ashley Cole off as well. Just an opportunity for those players that I wouldn't normally take off to, to come off. Obviously, apart from Perez, he comes off whenever he's a bit tired. But you forget about your Ashley Coles and your, your Thierry's. They just do the job day in, day out. Not bad, not at all bad. Dennis there, absolutely nailing it. God love him. Hopefully Adams will be back as well and we can... Oh, new board take control of Chester. 3.5 mil. I never, ever, when I'm Chester on this game, get that opportunity. 3.5 million. Bloody hell, man. That's what you call lucky. I did actually go for Festeveld here. I made the mistake of, of trying to sign him as a rotation player. So, yeah, my fault. But, again, I don't know whether to stick to uh, Richard Wright. I know that at the minute I'm playing David Seaman in goal. Right, let's get Tony Adams back in that play there. Yeah, he seems okay. Um, right, let's get Youngberg back in that position. Why are we playing Spart... Oh, no, it's... I thought I was playing Spartak Moscow away twice then. That was weird. No, it's Leeds. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see if we can push these on here. I'm desperate to get Klomp. The more I think about that defender, the more I want him in this team. I look at, like, Tony Adams and Martin Keogh, and I just think... I mean, they'll be good for this season. Don't get me wrong. I'd probably play them for the majority of this season. Uh, but I'm thinking for next season to go with Campbell at the back. Klomp is probably going to be the best the best player that I could get in that position. Obviously, you've got Cannavaro who would, who would possibly come after a couple of seasons like he normally does. But um, in terms of one for the future, Cannavaro is more of a quick fix, I suppose. 2-0 here as well. Not bad. Top of the table. And then we do face Leeds on the 13th. So there's a bit of a gap there, which is really good. So I can just play these players like normal. Um, I'm just going to get on Tierra. And he's doing bits, isn't he? He is. Fifth goal of the season. Fantastic result, that. Well done. Okay, first. Where are United in this? They're third. Clomp bid rejected. Right. Let's just gradually go up. Let's see if we can get anything for under a mil. Oh, how long's he out for? A month. That's frustrating. Now, that means that Vieira is going to have to go in that defensive midfield role, and Paul is going to have to come in and take his place in the middle, which could still work. He would take control of Everton. Six million. As if Chester got four million. New board taking control. Club Bruges. Wow, that's a good signing. Frederick Canute. He's not a bad player, is he? Then 
there are some really good players <coughs> right leads away this is a massive game um, I'm actually thinking here that we may have to change um, the attitude maybe press in offside trap um, Oh, we'll go normal. I'm going to change the mentality. If we go to normal, let's see what happens there. Um, <clears throat> leads are quite tricky to to play against. Eesh. Right, we're going to have to go attack him. Come on. Part of me thinks that it was a bit of a mistake not to go attacking. Um, oh, fucking David Seaman playing a four. Come on. Sol Campbell playing a five. Jesus, man. Bergkamp's been playing a, a steady six for the entire game. Nah, it's not coming, is it? Ah, oh, that's a bit gutting. That is a bit gutting. That puts us right back. Well, not right back. Three points off the top of the league. <coughs> it was. It was a poor result. It wasn't a good result at all, um, but to be fair, we've got the the North London derby coming up uh, after the Spartak game, so that'd be quite interesting to see how we get on there. He's gone to Dortmund. That's not a bad signing for Dortmund. Dortmund have some good players, you know. They really do. Clomp bid rejected again. Let's just just go for one mil. Right, okay, so next game is Spartak Moscow. Right, guys, I'm going to leave it there at this point. Um, play, again, thank you so much for the love on these videos, the likes, the comments, uh, the subscriptions. If you're new to the channel, uh, please make sure that like button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. It helps a lot. Bye-bye.